Hello everyone, in today's Lightroom mobile tutorial, we are going to learn how to edit dark sunset images and bring back lost details from the image. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Alright, so we are inside the Lightroom mobile app. Now let's bring our image inside the app. Click on this plus icon and select the image that you want to import inside the Lightroom. For this video, I'll select this image. I shot this image with my camera during the sunset and this is the raw format not the JPEG. That means you can bring a lot of details during the editing. As you can see, the image is quite dark. So first thing I'd do is to adjust the exposure or simply the brightness of the image. Go over here and press the light icon. Now simply drag the slider. Left makes the image dark and right makes it brighter. For now, this must looks better to me. Now you might have noticed that we got the details back in the bottom part of the image, but we are losing a lot of detail in the sky after increasing the exposure. But don't worry, we'll bring that back in a moment. For that, click on this masking icon and then press add. Now this will give you a plenty of option to choose from. You can select only the sky, the brush tool or different gradient tools. But for now, we'll choose this linear gradient tool. Now simply tap on the screen and drag in any direction. And as you do that, you'll see this red color overlay on top of the image. So currently we are just defining the area where you want to edit. And this red overlay just tells that. Also when this linear gradient is active, all the tools that you see over here will work only for that part of the image where you have applied the gradient. Go over here and press this light icon. As you can see now, we have got the lost detail back in the sky. Now you can also change the gradient area and direction if required. You can change the position, the rotation as well. To rotate, simply tap on this and drag left or right. Once done, click on the stick over here to apply the changes. To check before and after, long press on the image. So this is before and this is after. We have already improved the image a lot now, but I feel we can increase the saturation as well. Because currently the colors are looking very dull. So for that, slide this toolbar and tap on this color icon. And increase the vibrance and saturation as much you want. I want to add clarity in the corner of the road. So for that, we can add one more linear gradient from this corner. After adding the mask, go over here in light and decrease the exposure first, then go in effects and increase the texture and clarity. One thing I want to change over here is the white balance. I want this area slightly towards the cool temperature. So go in color and do the white balance adjustment accordingly. I feel this much works for now. Once done, click on the stick icon to apply the changes. You can take it one step further as well. Let's say you want more drama in the sky. You want those texture of the clouds to really come out of the image. So go again in masking and choose the mask that we have applied in the start. Then go in effects and increase the dehaze and clarity value. Now I want this area just below the bike to be a bit brighter and also will add some clarity. So go over here in masking and choose radial gradient this time. Now define the area and increase the exposure a bit. And then from effects, increase the clarity and texture. Alright, time for the final before and after. So this is before and this is after. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you can consider liking the video and subscribing the channel as well. We'll see you in the next video. Till then, keep creating and enjoy the process.